This is Dr. Robert Chase, Emil Holman Professor of Surgery at Stanford Emeritus. During my army service in Italy, and later when teaching at the Stanford campus in Florence, I became intrigued by the great collection of anatomical wax models displayed at La Specola Museum in Florence. The waxes of La Specola, they are uncomparable. They are a view, an image of immortal beauty, we can say, immortal anatomy. I couldn't imagine something more beautiful than waxes to see what anatomy is. Learning from the wax models is a great supplement to the cadaver work that is already taking place in the medical school. What makes the waxes so incredible is just how intricate they are. Being able to see models really magnifies how precise and beautiful all of those structures are. I was introduced to the waxes by Dr. Bob Chase. This is almost 20 years ago. He photographed about 18 or 20 of them and we used them to teach the medical students so I wanted to embellish the collection, so I asked the people at La Specola that if I could raise the money, could I photograph some more? So they said that, yes, of course, they haven't been photographed in 50 years. So we photographed them in stereo, and then we went back and scanned them in 3D so we could use them on the table. So now we use them on the virtual table, and we use them in the classroom. are really a masterpiece in science, in art, and in an illuministic concept of teaching to the people. The magic of the waxes is not only their accuracy, but also our ability to interact with it, to ask questions about it as a student, really get to play with this tool. And I think that the sculptors would be, they'd be pleased with, with this technology and how we're using it here. The future of anatomy education is going to involve these virtual tools and technologies. It's amazing that we can use these centuries old models, which still have so much to offer in their understanding of the human body and integrate this knowledge to what we are doing today.